Um, hello. I'm gonna be recording a video on how to make an MP3 file usable in Smash. So, first, you, of course, you need your MP3 file, which I've got Bombwash Plush from Smash Ultimate, which I'll be modding into my game. And you'll need to have installed um, Fubar, which makes it be able to run IDSP file, IDSP files, and you'll need this component, which I'll link. So when you get Fubar installed, just like a Google search, I'll also put a link. Go to preferences, go to components, install, and add the VGM stream plugin, which I put right here. I've already got it installed, so uh, I'll leave that. Um, Audacity, which a lot of people would probably already have Audacity installed. And also, you would need just the MP3 file. And if you want to mod it into Smash yourself, you'll need Smash 4 Explorer, obviously. And you'll need a dump of the newest game of Smash. And, yeah, that's about it. Oh, and you'd also need this file, this NOS Free Bank editor, and you'll need Python installed. But I'll link this as well. I've updated my Google Drive. So, I've got all these ready right now, and I'm going to open Audacity, and open bomb bombwash plush bombwash plush I've got bombwash plush now in here you need to increase it by 5 decibels and ic no export was it export as wave you could just leave it the name as whatever. At this moment, you only you can have it as whatever. And you'll also need a um a NOS free bank file so you could copy it out. But I'll just I've already got NOS free banks, so I'll just open my Smash Four Explorer, my workspace. And just copy one of these. I'll copy this one. Copy. Let me open it some more. Just copy it into here. And so the next step would be so this is this not free bank. So you can get it off custom smash music if you don't have any before I'll show you how to do that quickly the website usually is usually down a lot but it might be up today yeah it's up so oh, that's not how it's super There's ultimate, here it is. This should only be like the menu theme up right now. There's not many people, so E3 main menu. Just open it up. Or any other song, like from any other game, they usually upload a lot. You don't need a template, just download NOS Free Bank straight away. Or you could do NAS Ghost, NOS Free Bank. Let's just you can download that, save it, and also have your MP3 from whatever you want. A normal song, another gaming song, whatever. And so, you would, after you do that in Audacity, you would open the Nuts Free Bank Editor. Nuts Free Bank Editor. You need Py for this part, you need Python installed for it to work, obviously. So you do File, open Nuts Free Bank, um, Desktop. You'll need, well, this is root 201. 
have installed Smasher. If you've got a few parts installed, you should be able to hear it. Then replace this menu, .isdsp, with the wave file for super no, not see. Bomb, bomb wash blush. Where did I save it? Where did I save it? Oh, I think I forgot to save it. Let's go through all that city again. So oh, I opened the wrong. F that makes more open. Actually, let's go. Um, new. Open bomb wash This isn't music. So I gotta get back to desktop modding. Modding, modding modding. Open bomb wash blush. Uh, like I said before, five decibels higher. Or a little bit higher if you want. Just depends on how loud the track is. File. Export as wave. This doesn't really matter. It should export the WAV file. Okay, that's all you gotta do. Close, nope. Close, nope. So now, go back to the IDSP editor, or the Null Street Bank editor. Open Bomb Wash Blush WAV. No loop was detected, it will add a loop because then it will keep running in Smash, obviously. Um, I usually save it and then open Nuts Free Bank Editor again. That always comes up, that's fine. Boop. There you go. Successfully, then save. Saved to that. Uh, close. Oh, actually, yeah, I'll just close. Then, now it says no file open, then open Nuts Free Bank here. That's longer than a normal time, so the loops are right. The loops are right and working, which, you know, good for what Smash wants, so that's all you gotta do for injecting it anyway. So save again. Open here. Um, of course, when you have a file in Smash, you'll always have to have this sound underscore bgm underscore. You got always got to have that. So add that, and then have um, bomb blush blush from ultimate ultimate. There. Just got to copy that into your Smash Four Explorer workspa workspace workplace whatever you have it. Sound BGM. Just paste it in here. Then, this is a little bit tricky. So you'll have to have, obviously, Smash 4 Explorer. I'm from Australia, so I've got the European copy of the game. And I just, you only see the English one, because that's all I need. You need 304, which is 1.1.7, and Europe, obviously. Game ID, which is Smash. Um, you'll then have to open the Smash 4 music plugin, which should come with the mod pack. And I need a refresh, because I just put it in the folder. And done. Smash 4 music. Okay, so these are all the tracks in the game. These are all the ones I've added. So you need to keep clicking add until one gets to the bottom. So here, at somewhere at the bottom now, and title of the title of the do this the, the, the song, bomb. Blush. Um, you can copy it into. This is the sound test. It also shows the sound test. This is description. You can add whatever. This is just when you're in the sound test as well. You add the composer and stuff if you want. 
source is that the game it comes from, so I'm just going to write Splatoon. And I'll save it as Splatoon. And then, here, you'll have to type the file you named it before, but without the sound, thought .bgm. So here, this is the sound source. It will show up for the DLC update sound. Let's leave it as core game sound. Original. This will show up. I'm going to add it as Remix Red. Smash Bros. This is the icon you can add. Kirby, Smash Bros., Sonic, whatever. And, you know, I'll just put it as... Oh, this is Smash Bros. Roster. This, this is just... Whatever. Reorder. You have to go to reorder. Click... I'll go back. Save order. Exit. Stage edit order. And click... Etc. Etc. And then click save ordering exit. Uh, now, you go back, go off. You'll have bomb rush plush here, but that's not. I'm going to click compile. I'm going to click open again. I want to click compile again. And I'm going to open it again. That's so all of the um, files before that you had were empty or all gone. So now, go to my music. This is um, all your stages Battlefield. Uh, in the menu, this is what you can edit. So here's the menu, I'm just going to add. Um, should be at the bottom here. Bomb Rush Blush 579. You can click add. Add to the BGM in My Music as well. It'll be here, which is a normal name. So it'll be in My Music. I can add it to you. Oh, Smashville. They've got some weird names, so you'll have to find it. should be Village 1. Village. Oh. X Village and this is um Smashville and Village 2 is town and city. So X Village I'll add it. I'll add it to town. I'll add us both. I'll add it to town and F D. Which will be end F. There's only one end F, obviously. And there's two battlefields. Big battlefield, battlefield. Whatever. And yeah, some of these music you like you won't know. These are just the hidden ones from the single player. You can't play these normal. Yeah. But now, you can see. Bomb Rush Blush is now in the game. But. It's here. Compile. And you gotta extract your mod pack. Or build. Done. Here you go. That's literally about it. Or. Uh, Add the um, links, these are all the download links, and that's it, basically. So, yeah. Uh, just, when you do that, just make sure it's all running right. If it, you mess up the Audacity and the IDSP part, it will be a bit of trouble. If you can get um, a NOS free bank yourself, you should do that instead of going to the website. But, you know, the website is down a lot because of this payment issues, but it's a pretty good place where you can find most gaming songs. Let me go back. You can see games from like whatever Street Fighter, a anything, 3D Pinball, Advance Wars, Ace Combat, Ace Attorney, every Smash game usually has like all their tracks. I'll make it, I'll go look at Thor, and Thor's got the best track. Um, Thor. That's not here, since S. S. See this next one is Thor. 300 songs. Obviously, it's got a lot of songs, it's got the best tracks in the series. Obviously. It's, it's such. It's got Melee, it's got 64, it's got Project Dem, it's got Ultimate already, it's only got one song. Already. Uh, this, it's got everything here, it's actually a song, Brawl Battlefield, version 2. It's got, Menu 2, it's got, Rob's Victory theme, you know, who doesn't love Rob? Everything just like it's got most of the tracks in the game, obviously. Uh, yeah, you can install this the same way. Just, just download the Nosfree Bank and install it from 
plugins, and yeah, that's about it. So, thanks for watching, I guess, and I'll just have all the links in the description, and I hope this helps, and this is by far the easiest way to make MP3, not free banks. It's been a lot hard in the past, and just through modding, it's just a lot better now, and yeah, thanks for watching.